on this week's two minute tip we're talking colorful cauliflower cauliflower is one of my favorite fall crops to grow for several different reasons the first one is that we can succession plant it. We can plant it several different times throughout the fall and get several different crops. We can start some transplants in August, start some more in September, and sometimes even start some as late as October. The second reason is that it stores very well. Unlike a crop like broccoli that's gonna store just a few days in the fridge, we can usually get up to two weeks of storage out of cauliflower once we cut it. And the third reason is simply the taste. Cauliflower is one of those vegetables where there's a huge difference between homegrown versus store-bought. Nothing can beat homegrown cauliflower. It just has a great texture and a great flavor. So we'll start our first round of cauliflower transplants in late summer or late August like it is now. And we've got three great varieties that are heat tolerant. They're gonna do well in early fall and do well on into late fall. We've got the snow bowl, which is a white cauliflower, makes a really bright white head, has really good wrapper leaves to protect it from the sunlight. We've got this yellow variety here called flame star. It's almost like a cheddar color and it does really well. And you don't have to worry about the sun bleaching this as much because you're wanting it to be this yellow or orange color. And then lastly, we've got this beautiful purple one here called graffiti. And this is a nice one as well that's heat tolerant and you don't have to worry as much about the sun bleaching the color because it's supposed to be purple or darker than a traditional cauliflower head. Now the flame star and the snow bowl are fairly early maturing varieties. They're gonna grow out in about 50 to 60 days. The graffiti or the purple one takes a little longer. So you'll be harvesting these guys before you do the purple one. We always hear nutritionists talking about eat the rainbow. Eat lots of colors because that's what's healthy for you. And if you grow all three of these, you'll certainly be doing that. You've got the white, more traditional cauliflower, the yellow one, which is really rich in vitamin B, and the purple one here, which is really rich in those anthocyanins, which we all know are good for us. So get your fall cauliflower planted now. I'll put some links below so you can check out these great varieties. I hope you enjoyed this week's two minute tip. We'll see you next week.